Eric Kaneva has been in the spotlight for all the wrong reasons. For a while, he's been the go-to guy in the village of Nsanje when it comes to a controversial traditional rite, the sexual cleansing of girls and women. Known as a hyena, Aniva is brought in to sleep with young girls pushed by their parents. The custom is meant to prepare pubescent girls for marriage. That's despite the risk of exposing them to HIV. In his defense, Aniva says he provides the service, but still champions a cause to end the ritual. When parents of these girls come to me because they promise to pay me, I do perform the ritual secretly so that no one knows about my actions. In fact, I don't want people to say why is this man doing this when he is the champion in ending these rituals. <laughs> My rights were infringed upon. I realize now that I was forced to sleep with a man whom I did not choose, and it was not even my time to have sex. So I still feel bad about it because I never wanted it, and this was an old man. Earlier this week, Aniva was arrested after President Peter Mudarika ordered police to investigate him and his accomplices. This is after a revelation that he indeed was HIV positive and was performing the rites without any protection. The president even wants more punitive flaws enacted to end such practices. Uh, I, I think it was uh, uh, a wise decision uh, to for this man to be arrested and investigated. And then he found uh, that he has actually violated the law. Uh, he will be tried uh, and convicted. And I think that will send a signal to other, other people who may be doing this, uh, that this kind of practice is unacceptable. And as I say, eventually we'll have... Uh, a more comprehensive law uh, governing um, uh, cultural traditions uh, which uh, are harmful to society. We need to understand that this is a deep-rooted culture. As such, arresting this man is no solution in itself. Rather, government needs to do more civic education from the grassroots. Last year, Malawi passed a law banning child marriage and raised the minimum age for girls to marry to 18 years. However, that means little to most societies on the continent that still hold on to the view that girls should marry as early as possible to maximize their fertility and also to reduce the financial burden on their families. Leslie Marungu, CCTV.